The push to legalize same-sex marriage in the Ocean State continues right now. Tonight, hundreds of people rallying at the State House as the House Judiciary Committee considers two different measures on same-sex marriage. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotnik is live outside the State House with more on today's hearing. And Mike, hours later, hundreds of people still inside the State House right now. We're being told from someone that just walked outside, still waiting to give their opinion on same sex marriage, whether they're for it or against it. Again, hundreds of people signed up to give their opinion on this. And this is a debate that started very early here today and does continue to proceed right now. The heated debate on same-sex marriage started early Wednesday at the State House. Plenty of shouting, but also plenty of constructive and debate. Two men cannot create a child. Two women cannot create a child. Not all sexual relationships, the whole purpose of sex is not just to have a child. Hundreds lined up to get in the State House early, and dozens and dozens of people signed up to get their voices heard before the House Judiciary Committee. Let's not redefine marriage. The difference is the difference. Until we live in a community that embraces diversity and supports equality, we feel forced to move out. Two bills right now are up for debate, one sponsored by Representative Arthur Handy in favor of same-sex marriage. He wants the lawmakers to vote on it. Representative John Brien sponsoring the other bill against same-sex marriage. He wants Rhode Island taxpayers to vote on it. Governor. Chafee is, has, has been a supporter of the gay community for a very long time. He believes in the gay community. He believes in equal rights, and I think this is the time. I think it's something that really all the people in Rhode Island should definitely have an opportunity to vote for, first of all. And I, I, think, um, you know, I think that same-sex couples can achieve some of their goals but different ways, but not by redefining marriage for everybody. So nearly seven hours later here at the State House, people still inside trying to give their opinion on what they think is fit. Of course, no decisions will be made tonight. There are still several more steps in this process. Reporting live tonight outside of the State House of the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Catherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.